I'll need this. This one as well. I'll grab this. I'll grab the sweet lens because it's so good in low light. So I will also need to grab my drone and my GoPro as well. By the way guys, I'm not crazy. I'm just testing out new lens. I'm sitting like the other side of the room and, and it's zoomed on me. But I can't get any further away. So in today's video, we're going to visit the Marble Arch Caves. <laughs> Children, 25 quid, that's a decent price. This is an Enniskillen, so it's gonna take us like an hour and a half, an hour 40 minutes from Lisbon. Let's go to the caves. Come on! Yeah! Yeah! So Archers be going, it's a cave, and then underground lake. What do you think, Lupa? Uh, I think it'll be fun, but also scary. Hey. Last time you said you're not gonna be scared of anything. Yeah. Yeah, are you excited? Mm-hmm. So guys, we're heading off to Marble Arches. Um, it's about an hour and a half, an hour and 40 minutes drive from here. And it's killing. We're in Lisbon. Are you excited to go? Yes. Yay. Well, let's go then. We stop for a short break at Carry Bridge because you want to see this place. Where will we get down? We just walk. What about you, your feet? Honestly, this place is like the Irish Miami Beach. Another 20 minutes or so driving and we were right at the Marble Arches Visitor Center. Apparently it's going to be really cold inside. It's really warm here. So once you check into the reception with your booking, you'll be allocated into a group of 10 people and you'll have a guide who will take you around the whole cave and explain you everything inside. When this ice melted, the cave roof could no longer support its own weight, causing it to collapse inwards. Now this exposed rock that you see over here is Dartry limestone, which is a sedimentary rock. And about 320 million years ago, this would have been a tropical ocean. Take your time coming down them. All right. <laughs> This is one of my favorite formations, the giant mushroom. Normally there's a boat ride, but due to COVID, unfortunately, this is a walking tour today. If you haven't packed any food for your journey, then Lillian's lovely coffee shop at the visitor center will get you covered. Finish the day with a little bit of exercise, take a little walk in the surrounding areas, you won't regret it. 